Hello world, I am Simobius and welcome back to Let's Play Jaws episode 3. Now, you may be wondering right from the get-go, why didn't I do my cool little robot voice intro? What's up with that? You're not the real Simobius. No, I am. I am the real Simobius and the reason why I didn't edit anything is because this is going to be a totally unedited video. I'm planning on finishing this game. If you guys saw my last episode, episode 2, we got this close apparently. We were a millimeter away from winning the game. Winning in big quotation marks. We couldn't find the electric room, but I've continued to play a couple minutes more and I found it immediately. So I'm just going to play this for you guys and just show you guys the ending, what is considered to be an ending. So let's just jump into it. You guys already know the rules of this game, how it works. So let's finish this game up. Ah, uh, did it freeze now? Did it freeze? Is this how this game works? This didn't happen last time. Maybe I will end up editing this video. Nope, just kidding. Hmm. Okay, so that's a little weird. I wasn't expecting this. We usually don't spawn in this corner of the map. Alright, well anyway. Anyway. This is the same game that we left off in with the update, most recent update, where they got rid of the fake generator that was giving us so many problems in the very first episode I played this game. Terrible idea. Why would you make a generator that that actually is just the same thing as everything else? Hold on, how do you, okay. So the goal right now is to turn on the uh, the uh, gas generator, we found the real one this time, and so we just have to go and find the stuff, the gas cans, which are pretty easy to find, they're just big green things. I say they're easy because I found one already, now watch as I miss all the other ones. And so we just put it in, and I already see another one in this corner. Yeah, hopefully this is going to be like a speed run kind of a thing because we all know what we're doing and we're not going to die like an idiot. And this is actually a pretty good strategy is to just go as quickly as possible and clear all the objectives as quickly as possible. Because once these waves of guys just start pouring in, then it gets harder than it should be. Okay, he's not running. We don't need to worry about him right now. Let me just put this in here. And I know the other gas can was just behind the one we just picked up. So let me just run past. Excuse me, sorry. Don't mind me. I'm just going. I just need some gas. I just need gas. Don't mind me. Can I have that, please? Okay. No, oh God! Oh. oh, there's another gas can that we don't need. Excuse me, sir. Can you not charge me like that? I don't much appreciate being charged. Okay. So that's it for that. And now we have to find the security guard. I'm thinking that was the next objective. Find security guard. Um, so we're going to have to do a little bit of exploring. As, as, as exploring. But we're going we're gonna to have to find the dead guy and take his key. Uh, this might be where I actually edit and put a jump cut in here because this is gonna take a while apparently. And I need to find the other gun before I die like an idiot. Okay, that was a cone. A very solid cone. Okay, well found the other gun. Yeah, and those green needles are adrenaline, adrenaline needles, adrenaline supplements. Oh God! Oh. I mean, I heard the footsteps, but I didn't expect him to be right there. God damn it! Ah, uh, good thing I didn't get a cramp in my neck from that. Jeez. All right, so back to finding dead, dead guy with key card. 
Okay. Um. Oh, great. Back, back where we were not supposed to be at. I'm like, yes, I have gone in here, but where is our key card man? Not here, apparently. Yeah, he's usually easy to find. He's just laying there somewhere. Is he in here? Nope. Is he is he in one of the stalls just taking a time for himself? Just taking a ease dump? No. I don't know if you could take a dump in this place. I mean, you would feel really uncomfortable. To the point you're just clenched. Hold on. Nope, never mind. Uh, still can't find dead guy. Probably have to insert jump cut here because this is some of that crazy. Nope, this is a new space, but still not anywhere to be seen. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go find the dead officer. I'll be right back. Officer! Officer! Where could you possibly be? Why are you dead? I need your help. Where could you possibly... Oh my. Oh my. Among these magaz controversial magazines. Jazz fine. Jazz time. Sure. Sure, officer. Sure, it was jazz time. Give me your key card. Luckily, we're close to the place we need to be. Right here. Open. And so we can... There's actually a gun in here. This gun. So you actually unlocked a gun when you unlock that door. Which is really, really nice. Because... This is a super powerful gun. Two shots. Um... But yeah, you got these two-shot rifle. Still haven't find, found that damn revolver. I still have not been able to find the revolver. They say that there is a revolver in this game. But I haven't been able to find it anywhere. And how could I find it? There's freaking... It's a tiny gun hidden among a huge map. Oh, God. No, I'm not dying now. Screw that. I'm gonna go get that ammo before I die horribly. We're so close, actually. Now that we unlocked that door, now I can show you guys actually where the thing was. Let me just get this ammo first. And then apparently you have to drop your other gun. That's inconvenient. Oh my. Okay, last two. Okay, now we can go back. So yeah, the electric room apparently... The electric room is apparently right by the door you unlock. It's right here. Right there! Electric equipment written in big letters that I missed completely every time. Oh wait, the door must be opened by security? But I have a security key card. Don't I? Oh, you have to. Oh. Okay, there we go. See? And then you turn this on. So great. The lights are on and everything. Now you can see stuff. So that's great. This is pretty much the end of the game. This is what you call winning. Because now it's purely sass zombie assault type stuff that's going to be going on now. Endless waves of zombies. Zombie soldier things, whatever these mutants were. But yeah, it's pretty much an endless wave from here on out of just, yeah, see? As it says, stay alive as long as you can. Good luck and stay frosty. Of course, of course I'll stay frosty. Forever. 
this is pretty, you can call this the end of the game. You're pretty much going to be shooting zombies till the end of your days until you run out of ammo for good and you die a horrible death. There's no escaping, which is, you know, kind of a bummer in my opinion, because I mean, you like went through all this and then you just die and you're done. And I mean, it's like, what's the point? Uh, okay, but anyway, that has been Jaws. Hope you guys enjoyed the three episodes these were and finding out that there was no satisfying ending. Fantastic, okay. Well, needless to say, this game is has an update, but it's not finished, obviously. And there's a lot of things that they could do. There's a lot of things that they could add especially a proper ending to the game. I don't know if there is a proper ending and I just didn't play it long enough to figure it out, but I'm not so sure I want to be sitting here until wave like a hundred and then finally get rescued or something like that. So if you guys want to play this for yourself, I'll put a link in the description below. You guys can find it on Steam. Free game, recently updated. I hope that they update it again with some more cool features and maybe even multiplayer because I think this game would be a lot more fun if you could play it with friends. But anyway, I will see you guys. Thank you guys for watching this episode. If you guys liked it, please hit the like button and please subscribe if you are new to my channel. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Simobius out. <laughs>